One heart, together we are united, alone we are blighted. Baby, you must be initiated. Those kids out there, it's giving me nightmares. I've seen a couple of episodes of The Clearing. It definitely wanted me. I couldn't wait to see more of it. It is so good. Uh, and congratulations on that. I just thought we'd start with maybe talking a little bit about your characters and how they fit into the story. So if you could explain, Miranda, who you play. I'm playing Adrian Beaufort, who is basically um, a cult leader yeah. in, in this show um, mm. with a cult called The Kindred. Mm. And um, yeah, very much an antagonist in the piece. Yeah. And Kate, um, I guess we wouldn't call Auntie a very nice person. <laughs> Not yet, not yet, but give her some time. Yeah. No, yeah. no, clearly she's... To her. Yeah. <laughs> Auntie Townsend is clearly not a nice person. She uh, is sort of the, uh, not even the right-hand woman of Adrienne. She's sort of a little bit the dog's body of Adrienne. Yeah. Uh, she's a disciple of mm. the kindred, uh, and but she's ab she absolutely adores Adrienne uh, and is constantly, I guess, waiting for some kind of approval from her. I watched her and I made sure no one saw us. Did you? Is that why it's all over the news? I didn't mean to let you down. Everyone thinks you should be cast out, excommunicated. What do you think her motivation was? I was trying to think when I was watching it. I mean, is she, oh. does she actually think she's doing some good? <laughs> I, I believed yes, yeah. you know, like there's those that are like, you know, the used car salesman who mm -hmm. will say one thing to your face and then as you turn around completely change. But I felt like she really believed her mantra. I think she's changed her life so much from what it was that she believes that, you know, she, you can be a strong person and do all these things and I think she thinks that that she's in some way doing good for people. Certainly one of the hardest things to watch, particularly in the first couple of episodes, because I'm not sure where this will lead, but you know, we have basically these children that are very mistreated, mm. um, you know, and they, they all look the same. It is very creepy, but mm. um, yeah, just talk a little bit about that element, and especially it focuses on one girl in the beginning and her struggles with this. Mm. Yeah, that's what's so hard mm. in this story is that, you know, Often you have stories that are just about adults that are in cults and, and you know, they've made that choice for whatever reason, you yeah. know. But with these kids, they have no choice in this. They never chose to be a part of it. They're just, you know, either born into it or brought into it. Mm -hmm. um, so that's really tough. And I think, you know, to be put in a situation where you don't have a real mother, you have these aunties and this woman who's you know, pretending to be your mother, but oh. her idea of mothering is so skewed. Isn't it? Um, it's very, you know, it's really damaging for these, for these children. Mum? Hello, Angel. It's Mummy. I've been waiting for you. <laughs> You're not my mum. I'm so sorry, Adrian. It's a psychological jigsaw puzzle, yeah. in this show, yeah. uh, both in terms of the narrative and the characters. Uh, and so I think people will be really, really, as they watch, collecting information, putting things together, yeah. Yeah. but still getting very yeah. surprised by some of the twists and turns. Yeah, that, that I think they'll place. be shocked in the end Yeah, what actually happened. Mm -hmm. And just talk about filming this in Australia, an amazing cast and great, uh, a great group of people. Yes, such oh, yes. an amazing cast, so great. I really loved working with everybody on this. And it's just so nice to be able to make something of uh, like this that, you know, is, is such a big production and be able to make that in Australia and actually, you know, have the budget to, to you know, do everything that you need to do with the story. You know, it to go to those locations, you know, that's always, that's like, it's expensive to, to yeah. go out of town and shoot yeah. in places and do all that, it's hard. With such um, a big cast, yeah. too. It's a big cast. Yeah, mm. huge. Uh, yeah, and the locations are a whole other character oh, in the yeah. show Just as the well. Cinematography it's, and everything. Yeah, is. absolutely exquisite. So, yeah. yeah, I think people will get a real. Um, they'll they'll see a different kind of Australia worldwide. Mm. It'll be a different kind of Australia that mm. they're seeing in the clearing than than any other um, series or film that they might have seen yeah. shot here.